Step six of this project is the final milestone in the outside design of your rocket. Today we're going to be attaching the launch lugs. Now launch lugs are the mechanism by which your rocket will be guided by the launch rod. Without a proper launch rod and launch pad, your rocket will not fire straight into the air. So to do this, we're going to take a ruler and we're going to draw a straight line down the entire rocket. Now make sure you do this away from any obstacles on the outside of your rocket, whether it be stopping pins or fins. Also, if your nose cone protrudes too far off the side of your rocket, you want to watch out for that as well. Next, you want to take a straw and you want to cut the end of it off about an inch long. And then do the same for the other end. So you should end up with two one inch long straws. What we're going to do is we're going to mount these straws, one at the bottom, one at the top. So take your super glue and apply a generous amount on one of the straws and then attach it to the bottom. Now put the bottom straw really close to the bottom edge of your rocket tube. You don't want it too high or else the rocket engine is going to actually rest on the blast plate. This could interfere with the electrical charge coming from your launch remote. So keep it at least within a half inch of the bottom of your rocket tube. Now after you put your straw on your rocket tube, make sure you straighten it before it completely dries. Make any corrections you need. And then once you have it where you want it, go ahead and further glue it down on both sides. Checking as you do it that it's still straight. Once that's complete, go ahead and repeat the process for the top launch lug. After you have completed both launch lugs, go ahead and test this out if you already have a launch rod. If you do not have a launch rod, you can test it out later. But you want to slide your launch rod through the first launch lug at the bottom and then through the second one at the top. There should be very minimum friction going on as you move your launch rod in and out. This will indicate to you that you put your launch lugs on straight. And that completes video 6. I'll see you in the next one.